Ladies and gentlemen, it is your man in Japan, Jay Contra, here at the Yokohama Book Off Super Bazaar, joined by, what's your, what's your Twitter handle? Vita Gamer George. Vita Gamer George. And we're here at the Retro Corner, looking at some games. Hopefully you can hear us over the, uh, the J-pop, <laughs> J-rock. So as you can see, we have a lot of, uh, let's see, Super Famicom games. Even let's that start was really off. really cheap for Super Metroid, actually. Yeah, eighteen hundred's not bad. That's like eighteen bucks. What's really interesting to me is this copy oh of God. Rondo of Blood for two hundred. I actually bought this for at the Kita Kyushu Hard On, or no, oh. Kita Kyushu Mantarake. I bought it for ninety, like nine thousand yen. Oh, not bad. Yeah, that was a real good price. Because he doesn't even have the spine cover. What else have we got? That's the only PC engine game. Hold on, are these Wonder Swan? What, the bottom? Yeah. Yeah, I think so, right? Yeah. Some Wonder Swan games. Wonder Swan Color. I don't see any. Do you still have a Game Gear? No. No. Because like, I gave it to you, I think. Yeah, you yeah, to yeah. Fix it. I can't remember. No, it's the capacitors were busted on it, so I still haven't fixed it yet. <laughs> you still have it, though? Uh, yeah, it's at home, though. This is interesting. Oh, yeah, this is the shooter. Oh, wow. So this is, um... Is it like Shiragami? Yeah. Yeah. Shikiga Shikigami. It's a shoot. It's one of the few GameCube shooters, and it's like 1800 for this special edition box. That's pretty good. They also had... I've been trying to wait... Oh, no, did someone buy it? Well... Um, this is where you could get, yeah, Rogue Squadron 3. They had a complete, no, this is 2. They had Rogue Squadron 3, but it was like 4,000 yen, which is pretty cheap. Maybe it's 3,000. What else have they got? Oh, speaking of shooters, Ikaruga. Oh, that's... 4,500. 4, Normally you can, even at Trader, this has become like a 5,000 yen game. So you can save some money that way. What else have they got? Killer Seven, not bad. Mm, I like Killer Seven. Fancy Star, Zoids. <laughs> Didn't you? No. Sorry, I was talking to someone else about Zoids the other day. My kids is into it. Is Zoids? Because I remember watching Zoids when I was a kid. When I was like. Oh really? Yeah. I hadn't heard of it until recently. Yeah. I've been watching <laughs> Saga, but it's not playing now. No, Romancing Saga. It's no, it's horrible. So you know what happened is when I yeah. got the first, I got, was it Saga or Romancing Saga? Yeah. The first one. It's like you choose your character. Yeah. And I chose a guy and it's like. It's my girl. Yeah? Yeah. I chose someone who was like, oh, you have to go into this cave that is full of like triceratops. Yeah. Also those triceratops will kill you in one hit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I was like, this isn't fun. Oh, I no, don't like that. that. Just means look around for a different place first. Well, they didn't tell me that. So. Well, that's the point of Romance and Saga, is you figure stuff out yourself. Well. Big boy. I just wanted to have a fun RPG experience. <laughs> is it one of your streamers on this? Uh, no. My streamer is on Coliseum <laughs> currently. Coliseum, what is this? Pokemon XD Yami no Kaze Daku Urugia. Is Dark Lugia a real thing? I've never heard of that, so I don't know. Hmm. Oh, and Pikmin. You ever play Pikmin? No, but I, yeah, I really like it. And I like uh, Little King's Story, which is the same Yeah, it's the same kind of thing. Pikmin. Oh, yeah, and Cubivore. So, Cubivore, get, you want to know how much Cubivore is in America? Mm. Go on. It's like $150. <laughs> Here it is. It's, uh, but it's four, like 14 bucks. It's not a good game right now. It's fine. It's a fine game. Okay. I had fun with it. This is really that Crystal Chronicles box is really tempting. Well, and so is 900 this. 900 yen. 900 yen is really good. This, I've like, I never see this. So I thought this would be cool. But oh, I can't believe they. They don't have um, Rogue Squadron. That's unfortunate. Wait, do they have two copies? Oh my god. Yeah, they have, they have two copies of Rondo of Blood. Oh, no, they're the same price.
Do you still have Moe's N64? No, I gave it back to her. What is she going to do with it? Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah? Yeah, I gave it back to the snare
so that's what makes me feel old. Like, this is released in my lifetime. I don't know. What does it say this is about this guy? Looks like it was made by the Katamari guy. Um, it was a Sega game, but I can't tell like who made it. But I mean, thirty-seven bucks for a PlayStation game is not cheap. Especially, look look at this other. This should be in the showcase, like Train Simulator Kyushu, Kyushu Shinkansen. Yeah. Wow. This is seven thousand yen. This is seventy dollars. The train simulators are really expensive. Like Densha to go can get pretty expensive. Anything else? So there's another romantic saga. Horrible game. I don't know if it'll be but let's see what's in the boxes. Why is this in the box? See, why is this in a box, but then the $70 game is not in a box? Like, why is this? I guess. Yeah. Oh, my mistake. Let's put you back. Any other box games I missed? World GP 2006. It's like, yeah, I don't get it. Why do they put the 900 yen game in the box? I guess, and no one has bothered to buy it, so it's just been cursed to that box forever. We've got here Irisu no Atorie Grand Phantasm. Yeah. Oh, King of Fighters Maximum Impact. 891. Street Fighter EX3. Oh my god, that's for some reason Harry Potter is 2,700 yen. It was the Bangin' Days. Which one's that? I know, it's, um, Order of the Phoenix. Oh, okay. That's so lifelike, so realistic. You know, actually, what am I looking for? Um, I want Okami, but I want it not, because you can find the best, you know, the, the best version everywhere. I want the original version. Where would oh, I find Michigan. it? Oh, Michigan. Do you know that? Michigan? No. So, you know, um, Red Seeds Profile. What's it called? In no. Japan, it's called Red Seeds Profile, and I can't think. It's like a game where you're like a cameraman. <coughs> yeah. And you have to do, like, the angles, um, like a scary angle or a sexy angle. And, like, oh, people okay. are, like, dying at that time. It's like... Interesting. I don't know if it was ever... I think it was translated, yeah. I'd never heard of it. Red Seas Profile. I'll have to look up. It's like a really famous games director. You know, like... Oh, my God. Indigo... No, it's not Indigo. That's David Cage. David Cage. Oh, would it be... Oh, yeah, I know who you're talking about. Yeah. I just can't remember what it was about. And, like, a guy involved investigating the crime. Yeah. But this is the game that came before that game. Oh, see, so yeah, I know what you're talking about. I just can't... Wait, I'm getting the Google. But yeah, I almost never seen it before. Deadly Premonition. Deadly Premonition. That, that's the one. Who is that? Who made that? Spiral. Is it? 
I'm just trying to think of a guy who made it. Who was the director? Sui Hito? Mm. No. See, I don't see Okami anywhere. But that's sometimes an adventure. But I don't see it anywhere. See, look at that. They've got like... Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty copies. They have twenty copies of Kingdom Hearts two. <laughs> okay. Yeah, it's two dollars. It is worried. See, I know my thing. Uh, oh, here's subsistence. Four dollars for Metal Gear Solid Three Subsistence. Maximo. You should buy Mitchell. Yeah, I've, I've, you know, I'm just trying to budget right now. I gotta buy a Neo Geo. Yeah, I'll buy it for you. Yeah, I'll buy it for you. Hold on, Strike Witches. Oh, <laughs> it's an anime game. I don't know. How, I don't know how I feel about that. There we go. Real fan is 7,000 yen? Jesus. Oh, Dark Chronicle. I've been looking for this. Do I have this? I don't think I do. Or no, I'm looking for Dark Cloud. That's what I'm looking for. Yeah, you know, I don't see Dark Cloud... I'm also not looking for uh, for RPGs because they're too long. I don't have time for RPGs. Anything else? I mean, we already looked at PS2 stuff. I don't see anything particularly expensive. Oh, but here's Adventures of Tron Bon. Wow, yeah. This is another really expensive game. Oh, yeah? It's at least 100 bucks. But here, look, 18 Wow. Wow. I got Klonoa. Klonoa? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I like Klonoa. Yeah, I bought Klonoa a while ago. Still haven't played it. I think you can play it on Vita. You can get it from the store. Yeah, there's a lot of PlayStation games you can download yeah, from the store. Is. Don't I know it. That's why you need a British Vita because that has the best play, PlayStation does. Oh, it doesn't? You know, yeah, let's just consider that I think the PS3 is retro now. It's 10 years old. Yeah. Let's see, so rail fan. 7,000 yen. My god. This this is the most expensive PlayStation 3 game I've ever seen. Mm, yeah, maybe top. Oh, wow. Okay, because cause Densha to Go, I think, died during the PS2. Yeah. And then I think the Come, the staff moved over to this, although it's the Chicago Transit Authority Brown Line. I always really like that set. Really oh, this eco set? Yeah. yeah. Yeah, 14 bucks. This is a really good deal. Yeah, like 14 yeah. bucks. I had it, and I, like, I love Ico. Yeah. Is it Ico or Eco? It's Ico. It's Ico. What else we got? Builders, X2... Anime games. What else have we got? It's probably, really though, it's probably Eco, but people say Ico. Because it's Eco, Maybe, Nico, yeah. Trico, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Phantom Pain. I don't see anything else exceedingly expensive. I mean, there's a couple of, like, 2,000 yen games. Like, here's... I don't know Lego how. Marvel, 2000 or like 30 bucks. And then there's rain. Fifteen bucks. See, the thing about collecting PlayStation 3 is there's still a lot of games that have... It's cheap, but there's still a lot of games that have value to them. 
進むさいります。今朝の待ちの番号が三十四番、三十四番の待ちのお客様。I'm trying to think, oh, I want to see if they have any shooters. There's like a few physical shooters that came out for the PS3. Yeah, definitely. I still have my PS3 here. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Which model is it? It's the, the slim, so it's not the fat one, but it's not the, it's not the super slim. Let's see. Home front, lots of Call of Duties. Resistance. Rainbow Six Vegas. Three dollars. Oh, here's AKB 149. <laughs> Not worth that much. What are you even doing this? It's just dating them and you pick different yeah. options. So it's not just the AKB group, but it's also SKE, NMB, yeah, yeah. So and HKT. Wow, that's all. It's a lot of possibilities. And Steins Gate. Do you like Steins Gate? Yes. That is a very strong yes. Very strong yes. Very cheap. So this is this is Steins Gate. Yeah. And this is like. Oh, it's called something like Phenogram. It's like really long. Yeah, Phenogram. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I can't remember the English. But、um, it's like 12 short stories based around the Steins Gate world. Yeah. That one. So that's like 12 games. Wow. 12 mini games. 12 mini games for two bucks? Yeah. I mean, I got this for Vita. It was like 4,000, so. Yeah. But yeah, the original Steins Gate. I've not played that one yet.、Though. Oh, wow. Then Boku no Natsu Yasumi 3.、Mm. Summer holidays, 20th century. Thanks. <laughs> you know, I think we're just going to end it here. It's already been 25 minutes. Okay. We'll move on to the Vita and、okay. the more modern stuff. Okay. Although, hold on. There's a. Let's move over. There's some. What we're going to do is we're going to move straight over to the Game Boy Advance games. And we'll end it here because we've got, wow, Mother 1 and 2 for 45. That's pretty good. Yeah. And、then you know what? Yeah, let's just end it on Final Fantasy V for $25. Thereabouts. So, I've been your man in Japan, Jay Contra, at the Yokohama Super Book Off Super Bazaar, showing off their retro section. I'm going to go check out their more modern games in a moment. Hope you'll join me. See you next time. Thanks for watching, and mahalo.